Charlemagne is then, in some sense, the reviver of the Roman Empire, but he is also the founder of Europe as something not just a geographical expression, but a cultural expression. Whether it is a socio-political expression, um, time will tell. When the European Union, the Euro, and all these things that are sort of semi-unraveling now, were cemented in their current form in the early 1990s, in the, uh, uh, the treaties that established that were deliberately made in the territories that are neither French nor German entirely, but are really part of the old Carolingian patrimony. The treaties in places like Maastricht, uh, the location of Brussels as the capital of the European Union, all of this is really evocative of the empire of Charlemagne.